Hi guys, welcome back to Mozak's new World Empire channel. Yeah. This topic I'm about to talk about is so sweet, it's interesting. So someone asked, how do you sustain a note for a very long time without stress? Hmm, without stress. That one I that one caught my attention. Without stress. You want to sustain a note for a long time without stress? Without stress. Hmm. Let me think about it. Think without stress. <laughs> Mm, without stress. Okay, let's do stress less. This person don't like stress. Honestly, even me. If you don't like stress, you need machines. <laughs> the white man does not like stress. To wash clothes now, but has bought washing machine. I ask her, I hope cooking, you get cooking machine. Honestly. Eh? So nobody likes stress. Okay, how do you sustain without stress? First of all, start with the one that has stress, which is called long tone, breath exercise, breathing. As you are up, start. So I go, I start. So I don't sit like this. If I'm standing, I don't stand like this. So I stand straight. straight. I want to allow my chest to carry enough air as much as possible. So if I'm sitting, I sit straight. Sit up. So if I'm doing like this, now you see, I have, this guy is tucked in. So you see, if I do like this, air can fill in. So I wanna go, breathe in, as fast as you can, as much as you can, and then start releasing it, droplets. Small, 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 small. Drop the air a little, a little, a little, little by little. Mm -hmm. So I go. That is the stress. That's the longest that's the one, long tone I've ever That's the one had. you put stress. So you breathe in and start going gradually. Oh my God. You know this, my rib cage is up. The reason is because I want it to hold as much space as possible. If I drop my rib cage, voila, good day. Mm. And then I release it very small. Yeah. Consistently yeah. very small. So I go like that, so I'm able to sustain. Now, the one with that one has stress because you notice that the phone needs to be doing like this. You see them do like that because they are trying to, you know, use the last energy to push in, you know, some more air that they have inside. So they want to let in out, they want to let out all the air. So you see them do like this. That one has stress. But this person said he doesn't want stress. Now, the one without stress is why you need a machine. And in place of a machine, what I mean by machine is technique. a technique called the circular breathing. The circular breathing is a technique. It's a technique, it means that if you know the technique, you don't stress yourself, you sustain out of the normal human lungs capacity. Yeah. You go beyond the natural. So since the technique is like a trick, a magic. Every magic has a has a way they do the magic. Is the audience I don't know is a magic. Yeah. The guy, every magician that display on stage, they have a way they trick your we know. your 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 head. Yeah. And then you know, I used to watch a uh, magic revealed. Mm. This magic revealed. How did they do it? You know that somebody's under that put this one up. Then this one enter. Then this one now enter. Then this one now come. Before you know. But you didn't see the people walking <laughs> oh underground. No. That this is a trick. You know, magicians are fast thinkers. Fast people thinker. that think very fast, yeah. very smart people. So you have to be smart too to sustain. So that is called the circular breathing. I'm making too much noise. I have a class on that circular breathing. There are two breaths. You use. You have your normal breathing and your cheek breathing. So your you call it your normal embryo. And your cheek and broke your. You must 
be able to make a sound in the sax with air in your cheek that you do. So in that, so that's why I'm going to make my sound now. That one is going to be short because this is it's going to be very short because you don't have enough air in your cheek as much as you have air here. So this one is going to be long, short, long, short, long, short. So you go long and very short. That's all. Now it's called now a circular breathing because you are now beginning to you are going alternatively alternatively circular breathing in the sense of cheek push long push cheek push long push cheek push long push so i go with my lungs to push not my embroker i go with my cheek then i go with my lungs again I've told you that this one is longer. This one is shorter. If you do it the same, the same, the same, the same, time is going to come. You're going to have more stuff of air inside you. And then you're, you start, you have to now stop because you now have more air inside. So as you release your air, so when you notice that you are running out of air on the inside, that you switch to your cheek. cheek. It is, you now breathe in when you are pushing with your cheek. So in the presence of doing like this, I do. I'm taking in air as I'm doing. One of my students was doing it over and over, I didn't get it. I say, okay, now forget about when to do this, when not to do this. What you now need to focus on now is I don't want my air to stop. So if you notice, you can go more with your with your lungs. Go more with your lungs. Then, when it's time for you to breathe in and push, you will know it's like throwing inside water, inside a lagoon, or inside an ocean. You will you will know when you don't have air, you'll be gasping for air. So, in the place of gasping for air, that's the time you quickly use your cheek to push it and take in air without stopping your. So, first thing first. Learn how to push with your normal embroker. Learn how to use your cheek to use. Of course, your embroker will be altered. So you have to now alter your embroker and do. Then you can quickly continue with your air. Quickly. It's a quick something that only you is going to settle down to master yourself. You're going to take time. If you take, sometimes it takes you so long, sometimes it takes you so short, but don't give up. Keep trying it. Watch other videos that we have done on circular breathing. Mm -hmm. But that's how to do it without stress. stress. All right, I've done that question. All right, guys. Thank you so much for staying by to the end of the class. S subscribe if you've not subscribed. Um, thank you to my old subscribers. Thank you, thank you. Thanks for sharing the video. All right, guys. See you in our next video. Bye.